So if you are a person in your side of waveform free, whether this the 12th edition or the 13th that just dropped, you can expect to find project templates. Now these templates are helpful if you're trying to quickly set up a project to get going recording. But one of the problems that you may run into is I'm gonna show you something. When I click on singer songwriter, so this window opens up and now you see new project and you can put your title in, I put test new in, but you also see open default edit. You can save where you want it to be location wise and you also can still change the template here. You can do the default or you can do podcast, house of worship, etc. So singer songwriter create project. To open up the project, you notice all of these tracks are here, but they all have audio on it. So this is not exactly what I was looking for. I'm looking for just a clean slate, but I want the track set up the correct way so the way I can record. So let's go back to the welcome. But this time I'm going to, and I can actually exit out of this at the top. You'll see test new edit one. I can exit out of that and I can go back to welcome, which I'm on now. And then I can go to the same project singer songwriter. I can click on it. But before I actually click on it, there is a little tiny section here that says remove clips when loading templates. I never noticed that until just now. So that's why I wanted to make a video about it. So now when I go to load it, then I can click create project. Oh, sorry, I got to enter a project name first again. I'm sorry. Test new two. Notice that it's empty, right? And so now when I click on each track, it should be set up, at least labeled anyway, so that way I can record my vocals.